They don't need that legislation. No one needs that legislation. It's terrible legislation. It's the first time in the history of English common law in Canada that the government has dared to introduce compelled speech as a requirement in, the, in, our, in our country. There's no excuse for it whatsoever. And the fact that they're using the trans population as the excuse to move this legislation forward is reprehensible as far as I'm concerned. Okay. Even if somebody finds that really damaging to them? Well, if they find the misuse of a pronoun damaging to them, then they have more problems than is go that are going to be solved by the mere reconstruction of someone else's language. Mm. Besides, it doesn't matter what the excuse is. The government has no right to compel speech. This is the thing, is that the, the, the rationale is compassion, but the, but, the imp the, but the impulse is totalitarian. I don't care what the rationale is. I don't care how compassionate the rationale is. The government doesn't get to regulate the content, well, of my speech anyways, because I wouldn't comply with the regulations, with the law. Not under any circumstances whatsoever. And I feel that it's the moral duty of citizens to stand up against that sort of compelled speech legislation. There's no excuse for it whatsoever.